Today's lesson in English is remembering to capitalize proper nouns and proper adjectives when writing sentences. Let's do some reviewing. Proper nouns that are the names of people always have to be capitalized, such as Mrs. Netto. Both the Mrs. and the N in Netto are capitalized. George Washington, his first name and his last name are capitalized. Edwin Hubble, both capitalized. When you give a title of a, name, of a person's name, such as President Obama, the word president is capitalized along with the name of the president. President Obama, both of them are capitalized. Proper nouns of places must also be capitalized. When we're writing Saint Stan's School, all of those S's need to be capitalized. It's the entire name of the school. Minnesota is the name of a state. It's a proper noun, so it must be capitalized. Pacific Ocean, they both need to be capitalized because they're included in the title. In a word like Gulf of Mexico, the name of this place, the G in Gulf and the M in Mexico are capitalized. The little word of does not need to have a capital O. Just the Gulf of Mexico, the M in Mexico needs to be capitalized. Proper nouns that name things also must be capitalized, such as Declaration of Independence. Again, there's that little word of that doesn't need to be capitalized, but the whole title, Declaration of Independence, needs to be capitalized. Emancipation Proclamation. That's the name of a thing. They both need to be capitalized. This was what declared slaves to be free. Bill of Rights. There's that little of again that doesn't need to be capitalized. But the B in bill and the R in rights has to be capitalized. The names of days, months, and holidays also must be capitalized. Friday, April, Halloween, they always need to be capitalized when you are writing them. Also, the names of buildings and companies have to be capitalized when writing them in sentences. McDonald's, Winona City Hall, the entire name needs to be capitalized. Statue of Liberty, there's that little of again, it doesn't need to be capitalized. Target, the names of buildings and companies needs to be capitalized. Let's do some practice. So let's start off with this sentence. John Denver is Mrs. Netto's favorite singer. Now, if we remember our rules, the first thing we need to do to fix this sentence is we need to start it with the capital letter. Whoops, let's go to start it with the capital letter. John Denver is Mrs. Netto's favorite singer. Now, his entire name needs to be capitalized, so I need to go back and capitalize that. My name also needs to get capitalized. So I'm going to go back and capitalize those. John Denver is Mrs. Netto's favorite singer. And every sentence needs to end with punctuation. This is a declarative sentence, so I'm ending it with a period. Looks much better. Let's try another one. He was born on a Friday in December in Roswell, New Mexico. Every sentence has to start with a capital letter. He was born on a Friday. Friday is the name of a day of a week. It has to be capitalized. He was born on a Friday in December. There's the name of a month. In Roswell, New Mexico. Roswell is the name of a town. And New Mexico is also the name of a state, of a place. He was born on a Friday in December in Roswell, New Mexico, and it has to end with a, a punctuation mark. It's just a declarative sentence, ends with a period. Now it's all corrected. Let's try another one together. He liked to sing about nature, especially the Rocky Mountains in Colorado. Let's go back and fix it. 
Every sentence starts with a capital letter. He liked to sing about nature, especially the Rocky Mountains in Colorado. Rocky Mountains are the name of a place, the name of a mountain range. So I need to capitalize both of those beginning letters. He liked to sing about nature, especially the Rocky Mountains in, in Colorado is the name of a place. This is a declarative sentence. It ends in a period. Much better. Last one. You should ask Alexa to play some of his music. Has to start with a capital letter. This is the name of a device in your house, the name of a device like a company that made it. It's a proper noun. And I have to end it in a period because it's a declarative sentence. So I have made all of the corrections. Now all you have to do is ask Alexa.